Since the start of the protests against the al-Assad regime 17 months ago, Syrians living outside their country have been calling on the world to step in and help their cause. Saudi Arabia has responded more than most, sending arms to rebel fighters and humanitarian aid to civilian victims. When King Abdullah launched his appeal for Saudi citizens to contribute their own money, Syrians in America were elated. With the support from the Saudi Arabia and the call of the king, especially in the, in, in the, in, in the month of Ramadan, uh, where uh, it, it has two, uh, two messages. The first message that for every Syrian, for every Saudi and every Muslim has to remember what's going on in Syria during this month of Ramadan, where the people, they are enjoying food, uh, drink. There are others who are enforced by the Assad policies not to enjoy su such kind of food and drink. With the same time, it's at least uh, to provide some uh, humanitarian and for m some money assistance for different organizations who are helping the Syrian people. I think we all always rely on the g generosity of, of, the, of the Saudi society, and we also always rely on, on the support of the, Sa uh, of, of, of the government of Saudi Arabia support the Syrian people and the Syrian opposition. Syrian American leaders say King Abdullah's initiative is another sign that the kingdom is ready to play a greater leadership role in the Arab world. It's very significant, especially for the Syrian people who had been under uh, uh, slaughter by their government uh, for 16 months. It's very significant. It signifies the leadership of the Muslim world and the Arab world coming together and to coming to the realization that uh, they have to have uh, a leader that can really lead in terms of uniting their forces and trying to uh, protect uh, the, 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 the Syrian population uh, as, as a country. Mr. Mazen, an architect from Damascus who has been living in America for 38 years, says there is a great need for outside assistance. We talk to people uh, throughout Syria in many, many cities, uh, relatives, friends, and, and uh, uh, other people that uh, you know, express uh, their concern that uh, the, the needs, there is a, the, the country has been uh, economically disadvantaged. It has been robbed for 45 years by the regime. Now, the people are basically, I've known a lot of people, even talked to them the past few weeks, uh, they are middle-income people. They don't have anything to eat for the past uh, few months. Mr. Radwan, who heads a small research organization here, says there was a big reaction within the Syrian-American community to King Abdullah's appeal. It's uh, always been re well received, not only in Syria, but also in the region. I just uh, a quick on, on my Twitter account, there is many tweets uh, 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 greeting uh, the announcement of the Saudi king and they are calling for other countries, other Gulf countries, other Arabic and Islamic countries to do the same. As they anxiously watch the fighting engulf their country, Syrians living in America see the latest appeal by King Abdullah as a sign that Saudi Arabia is standing by the Syrian people in this, their hour of need. Burton Bolak, KSA 2, Washington.